Hello, today I'm going to show you how to add a delivery point into Calumet's HD Manager 8. First, navigate to Master Data at the top, then select HDA. On this you want to select the second tab for delivery point, and then you're going to see the options for changing delivery points. Depending on which device you have, Wonderbox or Superbox, it's going to change on how you do this. For a Wonderbox, it's very simple. There's only one delivery point, so you only have to set up your fueling limits and what the name is going to be for reporting purposes. So for fueling limits, we'll set 500. 500 gallons means that when an operator comes in, pushes in their code, the maximum amount of fuel that they'll be able to dispense is up to 500 gallons. Fueling timeout at 5 minutes means that the maximum amount of time between when the operator punches in the button and between when they will run the pump to actually dispense fluid is 5 minutes. If they take more than five minutes between putting their code in and actually fueling, it'll shut the pump off so it doesn't run dry. The max fueling pause is how long the pump will actually run while they're dispensing. So even though you have a fueling limit of 500 gallons, somebody was going to take an hour to pump that, we don't want that. So they have a maximum of 30 minutes to pump 500 gallons. And here the product name is used for reporting purposes inside the software for Wonderbox. For Superbox, it's a little bit more hands-on. There's up to five delivery points, and we want to make sure that each one is set with its own limits, its own timeout, its own fueling pause, and then it's displaying the correct name on the screen. So, to do this, I'll show you how to set up the product names for inside of the software, as well as for on the box. Here you can see we already have diesel, gas, red diesel, and I'll add a new one and just type in oil. Then I'll save it. You can see now we have diesel, gas, oil, and red diesel. Then I'll move to products. We want to make sure that this is in the same order as what our delivery point is going to be. So delivery point one is going to be diesel. Then we'll do gas, oil, and red diesel. We'll do the same exact order over here. Diesel, number two, we'll put gas, press save. Three, we'll put oil, press save. Four, we'll put red diesel and save. And depending on which ones you want to use, you'll have to put in your own here. So as you can see here, now we're going to edit and make sure that each one is set up. So delivery point one is diesel, that's correct. The product displayed name is diesel, that's correct. The fueling limit, limit at 500, timeout at 5, and pause at 30 is also correct. Now we'll select fuel, uh, delivery point two. Fueling limit 500, that's correct. Timeout five minutes, gas and gas, also correct. Number three, here you can see for the first time we have our issue. We want it to be oil, and we need to select oil on this one as well. Also, because it's oil, we don't want 500 gallons. We want to leave it down to 100 gallons. It's going to be pumping a little bit slower. We want to save that. And then number four, we want to select our fueling limit, 500, 5, 30. And we want to select our product name red diesel. You can see here, you should be able to select red diesel as our product displayed name. What we're going to need to do just to make sure it comes up is navigate out, navigate back in, and now we should be able to change our delivery point to 4 and then change that to red diesel. You can see here, if it's grayed out, once again exit out and come back in. So now we saved it and everything has been saved over here so you can see our products are in order and our delivery points are in order. That's how you set up delivery points onto Calumet's HD Manager 8. I hope this, was vi this video was helpful. Thank you.